Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. At Dimdex 2024 in Qatar, the China Aerospace Science and Industry Corporation, KASIC, showcased the CM501 Gigaampere's non-line of sight, NLOS, anti-tank missile, marking a significant advancement in military technology. This model, lighter than its predecessor CM501G, is versatile, designed for deployment on various platforms such as light vehicles, small ships, and helicopters. With a reported operational range of up to 40 kilometers, the CM501 Gigaampere's enhances the People's Liberation Army's, PLA, operational capabilities, particularly in challenging terrains. Derived from the CM501G missile series, first introduced in 2012 and exhibited at the 2014 Zhuhai Air Show, the CM501 Gigaampere's, along with its counterpart CM501 SA tactical missile, represents a strategic upgrade for the PLA. These missiles, conceptually similar to the US net fire and low system, have been integrated to improve control and response times in variable combat scenarios. The CM501 SAW conducts initial reconnaissance to gather crucial data for CM501 Gigaampere's deployment. KASIC expanded its reach into the export market with a multi-purpose precision strike weapon system showcased at the 2018 Zhuhai Air Show, featuring the CM501 Gigaampere's slash C.M. 502 missile and the CM501 SAW CM501X loitering missile. The PLA's deployment of these tactical missiles was revealed at the 2019 Abu Dhabi International Defense Exhibition. Poly Defense, a subsidiary of the Poly Group conglomerate, unveiled an inert version of the CM501 Gigaampere's at IDEX 2021. Designed for mounting on a 6x6 vehicle platform using the Dongfeng CSK-181 truck, this system is capable of carrying 16 LOS missiles. The accompanying Dongfeng Mengxi CSK-181 truck offers flexibility in transportation allowing rapid positioning of the box launcher with a crane. Poly Defense's promotional materials at IDEX 2021 highlighted the CM501 Gigaampere's integration into a larger system, including a surveillance and command vehicle along with an escort. Real-time data transmission facilitated by a small drone enables operators to select launch sequences based on reconnaissance information. At Defense and Security 2022 in Thailand, KASIC elaborated on the CM501 Gigaampere's system emphasizing its capabilities in integrated information combat, autonomous operations, dynamic deployment, quick response, and adaptability across various platforms. Equipped with dual mid-course guidance systems and TV and infrared guidance for the terminal flight phase, the CM501 Gigaampere's boasts impressive accuracy and success rates. Designed to engage a range of targets at distances from 5 to 40 kilometers, the CM501 Gigaampere supports various munition types, including a lightweight cruise missile for larger targets. The CM501 SAW CM501X reconnaissance unit further enhances the system's battlefield assessment and response capabilities. The introduction of the CM501 Gigaampere's NLO system in the Chinese Army signifies a strategic shift to reduce reliance on additional reconnaissance and support equipment, particularly vital in scenarios involving mobile enemy units. Moreover, negotiations for the sale of CM501 Gigaampere's missiles to Pakistan suggest potential integration into the Pakistan Navy's Z9 Harbin helicopters and 054AP frigates, expanding its operational scope. That's all for now. See you later.